Guys, guys, oh my gosh, did you see Amphibious Season 2 final episode? Oh my gosh. Oh, hi, Zidney here with another video of me talking about another animated show. And I'm so fired up to tell you guys about this. I know, I know, it's like, come on, Zidney, stick to one show. Why do you keep introducing us to new shows? Why are you so cute? But I'm telling you guys, the show I'm about to talk about is absolutely amazing. Don't worry, no spoilers. So, Amphibia is great. No, it's really, 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 I don't know how many really should I say, but it's really, really great. Amphibia is an animated show in Disney created by Matt Bradley. Matt Bradley is a Thai American animator, director, writer, producer, storyboard artist. He was greatly involved in Gravity Falls. You know, Gravity Falls, this show is also good, right? See, see where I am heading. Anyways, Matt based Amphibia from his childhood, especially during the time when he would travel to Bangkok with his family. He said that at the beginning of each visit, he would be immediately overwhelmed by how different Thailand was compared to California but by the end of the trip he never wanted to leave and that's how he envisioned Anne the main character felt as she arrives from amphibia with a magical mysterious box first overwhelmed by the wonders of the place but slowly loving it until she doesn't want to leave and this is so different from other shows where a strange character from a strange world comes to earth or America and then that character will slowly learn what's like here on earth blah 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 but with amphibia you relate to Anne as you both discover the wonders of this mysterious yet colorful place so in Amphibia, there are like these talking frogs, toads, newts, you know, amphibians. And of course, Anne gets to meet all kinds of amphibians, even gigantic birds and insects. And she even befriends a talking pink frog named Sprig. And you know, they become a family. Anne Boon Choi is a 13-year-old Thai-American girl who is fierce, funny, and so relatable. And she is voiced by none other than Brenda Song, who also has Thai heritage. And you may know her as London Tipton from The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, and as Wendy Wu from Wendy Wu Homecoming Warrior. I love... Brenda Song as Anne. She gives so much energy and emotion to Anne. Her raspy and excited voice is absolutely perfect for this 13 year old girl. <laughs> feel safe the main reason why i started watching amphibious because of brenda song i was like brenda songs in it count me in oh by the way i just want to give a big shout out to my good friend jazel for introducing me to amphibia this video wouldn't be possible without you all oh, right i forgot to mention that Anne is actually based off matt's grandmother it's so heartwarming to know that matt inspired our spunky and bun choy from his beloved grandmother Amphibia is also so funny. I know that usually animated shows for kids have a different sense of humor because they're usually targeted for kids. But Amphibia is different. Their jokes are sometimes kind of dark. They even make fun of death. It's okay, kids. Just pick a corner for me to pass away in. That one'll do. But they never make fun of serious topics. Even my sister who doesn't like watching cartoons laughs out loud. Amphibia is also so pretty. It's so visually appealing. The colors, the animation, the drawings are so pleasing to my eyes. Exploring Amphibia with Anne is so much fun because you get to discover these new places. The visuals are just bursting with colors. I also love their soundtrack. Violins are my absolute favorite. And of course, Amphibia is a story about friendship, growth, and change. You will learn a lot. Amphibia is already in its third and final season, and I want you to watch it before it ends. You still have time, so go watch the first and second season, and then go catch up on the third. Okay, so I know that this video isn't like the other ones I've made. It's a bit unorganized, but I am just so amped up for Amphibia, and I want to give it the recognition it deserves. Also, I think I ate too much sugar. Okay, I think I'm more calm now. I just want to say a big thanks to you guys for watching this video. I hope you understood my super duper fast talk. If you like Amphibia, maybe you've heard of Infinity Train. So here's a video of me talking about why I love Infinity Train. But if you prefer Japanese anime, I also made a video summarizing Studio Ghibli films in one sentence. Go check them out! If you're new here, don't forget to give a thumbs up if you liked the video. And I must warn you, if you subscribe to my channel, you will get loads of randomness. Okay, goodbye. Okay, the sugar's coming down now. Oh my gosh.